Today, we learn how to drive without the clutch. First thing you need to do is you need to understand a little bit about how the clutch works. So there's a hydraulic system that actuates um, basically a lever on the transmission that operates the clutch. So what that does is when you push the clutch in, it compresses fluid uh, through the system, forces that fluid to push that, that lever on the transmission. Now what we have going on in this car is that system doesn't work. So this is going to be basically like a failed slave cylinder, a failed master cylinder, a hole in a line, um, you know, all sort of common problems that you can see in a clutch system. So <clears throat> if, you're ha if you have an older manual car, you need to kind of understand that, you know, your clutch might, might break at some point. Uh, the lines get brittle and, and age and wear and break. Uh, lines can crack. You know, master cylinders just sort of wear out. Slave cylinders wear out. These are really common, common problems. So what you do, to at least get going in a manual transmission with a broken clutch, you know, a broken clutch system. So we're not talking about, you know, a fragmented disc or, you know, a clutch that's, you know, the actual clutch itself is broken. We're talking about where the system that operates the clutch is broken. So you have the master cylinder, slave cylinder, stuff like that. Um, in that situation, your, your actual clutch is still good. So it'll still push the power from the motor to the transmission. It's just you can't disengage that clutch um, to change gears and to stop and, and do the things you would normally do driving. So what you do to get started, you know, when it's safe and when you can go, when there's nobody in front of you, is you push the clutch pedal in because that's going to be your, uh, that's going to allow you to start the car. <clears throat> and then you put it in first gear and you start the car. And when you do that, the car will move. Um, so be prepared for that but it should start like normal. You should start in gear and you should just start rolling. So let's try that out. Maybe. So you see the starter has enough power to move the car, run the car uh, from a dead stop. So maybe, maybe on a hill or something it might struggle. The wheels turned all the way. You know, try to point it in a straight direction and just go so the hard part is that anytime you get to a stop sign or you know a road an intersection you're going to have to stop the car like that um, if there's no traffic i won't do that here just to you know save wear and tear on that that system so now the hard part shifting. Now, you'll notice I did that completely without the clutch, and I'll tell you guys how to do that while we're driving. So guys, how you shift, you basically have to, you kind of jiggle the throttle a little bit, give it a little bit more gas than you let off, that'll allow you to pull, the, pull it out of gear, that'll unload the transmission, and then when you find the next gear, you typically just kind of want to let off the throttle, let those RPMs come down, match that RPM speed, and sort of with a you know a slight pressure on that, that shifter, you know, just sort of guide it in as your engine crosses over the, the RPMs that you're matching.
watching guys please like and subscribe that really helps me out i'll keep bringing you car reviews we're gonna get the schedule worked out and, and get the cars that uh, i was trying to review in here um, get them filmed and get them out to you guys so thanks for everything i really want to thank my subscribers i really appreciate you guys uh, check out the website there's more automotive news at toledo-cars.com and uh, check out our new merchandise we have some built in toledo t-shirts uh, on sale those are coming in soon i'll have a, a sample i'll show it off to you guys and uh, hopefully you guys will like that and order some if not keep watching that's all we ask so thanks guys we'll we'll see you soon with another review and uh, more content in the future thanks <laughs>